Thank you, my little friends. Your performance was hotter than a desert lizard eating chili peppers. <laughs> See you all later. See you later, Uncle Stonio. Bye-bye, kids. Bye-bye. I wonder what's behind this door. Henry, this time you have the honor. Look, it's a parade. I love parades. Notice, kids, the marching band is standing still while we go past them on this moving sidewalk. Just a little invention of mine. This way, see, the band and the crowd watching them never get tired. What's that? Hmm, not sure exactly, but I think it might be coming from behind this door. Never seen such a beautiful garden. Wow, the flowers are huge. And look at the size of those vegetables. Look, you can see the ocean from here. Ah, what a pleasant surprise. One never knows which door leads to my backyard garden. Why, just the other day I walked through this same door and was in New Jersey. Quite a room, don't you think? This is a room? Of course. We really aren't outside, you know. We've just gone further into my hat. Would I love to have a room big enough to contain a garden and an ocean? Yeah, but tough when your mom asks you to clean it. I mean, vacuuming alone would be an arduous task, not to mention... Listen, I think that song is coming from over there somewhere. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Look, it's a little snail, and he looks kind of familiar. He looks familiar to me, too. I don't think I've ever seen a snail with sideburns, a pompadour, and a little cape over the back of his shell. Oh, thank you, Missy. Uh, you're too kind. They call me Snellvis. I come up here from the south. Mercy took me about a half a century. Well, greetings, Snellvis. Glad to make your acquaintance. These are my backup singers, the Snail and Airs. And for being so very kind and welcoming us to your garden, uh, I'd like to perform one of my many hits for you now. Fantabulosa Mundo!